you cannot stop my shine. Yeah. You cannot run me dry. Okay. Say okay, let me talk to you. Uh, look at me, look at me. Tell me what you see. Psalm chapter 34, verse 1. I will bless the Lord at all times. His praise shall continually be in my mouth. Hey guys, come inside. Welcome to episode 6 of Marianne House Tours. Today we're at the Ellison Park development and we're currently at the Birch House. This house is on the market for $725,000 and is listed by Morgan Alexander Estates. So I'm going to take you on a tour so let's start over with this side. So when you come into the right hand side of the property you've got two doors over here. The first door takes you to the downstairs toilet which is pretty, which is a good size and you have your inbuilt mirror here and a floating vanity with some storage space underneath. Behind me, you've got a floating toilet and we've also got a frosted window here, which is really good because outside is the main road, so it's good to have a frosted window so no one can see what you're doing inside the toilet. So I'm gonna take you to the next room. So next we have a utility, oh wow, it's really hot in here guys. So we have a utility in room here and it has a washer and dryer and it also has, has a sink here as well and you've got your boiler here as well and you've just got so much storage in here which is really really good so i'm going to show you guys the rest of the ground floor so come with me okay so back to the hallway we have the living room over here which is a really nice space so over here you've got your windows and this shows you the front of the property. So we've just got this quiet road. There's not that much cars that do pass by because we are in the countryside here. So this room has been designed by Alexander James Interiors. You guys might have heard of him in our last property. If you haven't seen the episode, make sure to check it out. So yeah, this is the formal living room. And we've got this over here. Comment down below if you know what this is, guys. This is so traditional. I love the wooden beam here as well because the living room is very modern, but when you have features like this, it brings out that traditional side to it. Over here, they haven't actually put a space for a TV, but instead of a mirror, you can put your TV there. So yeah, this is the living room. the door over there it has an access to your kitchen and dining over here guys this is the kitchen and dining area you've got this huge island in the center which has a gas cooker and has a lot of storage underneath and some drawers as well and above us we have a Siemens extractor over there which is great and behind we have a beautiful sink and a flat countertop which complements the white cupboards in this kitchen and over here, we also have a more seasoned appliances. So we have an inbuilt oven and grill and a dishwasher here below. And over here, I just love this area. So it's just like a hidden shelf area, which is really nice. Instead of having more cupboards, they have this over here. And below, we also have a wine fridge. And we have the inbuilt fridge freezer over here sorry we've been eating a lot guys so don't watch our food <laughs> and then we have the freezer below as well and over here we have the dining area so this dining table can sit eight people which is a big number and we also have just more space over here there's a tv plug as well so you can plug in the tv if you'd like and it has sliding doors to the garden behind me so i'm going to show you guys that now Okay, so before we go upstairs, I do want to show you something else downstairs, and that is this garage space. 
it's pretty huge. How many parts do you think you can fit in here? Um, I think maybe like three to four. It's three very to four? Big. Yeah. Three to four small cars, but I feel like if you get the range, it's pretty much taking most of the space. Yeah. But you can fit, if you don't want to fit your car here, because there also is a drive, you can put other things in here as well. So are you guys ready to go upstairs? Because I'm excited to show you what's upstairs. Come, let's go. Now, we're going to go upstairs, and upstairs is carpeted, which is really nice. So we're on the first floor now, and I'm going to take you into the first bedroom. So come with me. Okay guys, so the first bedroom has been staged to be a little girl's room. It is quite spacious for a kid's room. Over here they put a teepee, but you can put your cupboards here as well. And they've just put this rail over here just to show you how much space there is. And we still got a bit of room here before we have the single bed to our side over here. This is the second bedroom. They put a chest drawer over here, but they haven't put a cupboard. So you guys can gauge where you want to by looking at the space of the room. They put a lovely double bed over here, and I love, you guys know, I love a quilted headboard. And then we've got these windows over here, which show the rest of the estate. So let's take you guys to the family bathroom. Guys, before we go to the family bathroom, I just want to take some time to admire this hallway. We've got this beautiful high ceiling, and they've got some nice windows on top as well. And we have a nice window over here, so there's so much light in this place. Also, we have a digital thermometer here as well. I know that I mentioned that there was one downstairs, but there's another one here. So now let's go into the family bathroom. And guys, more sockets even in the hallway. This place is just filled with sockets, which is amazing. So guys, this, wow, it's got echo because it's huge. This is the family bathroom, and we have our floating vanity, floating toilet, indoor mirror, and we have an indoor bath with a shower and it has different controls so you know whether or not if you want to have a really powerful shower which is amazing and i love the tiling as well i love the gray it really complements the white um, theme that's going around in the property we've got the really high ceilings with the window on top as well and behind the door we have a heating rack we have a little storage space over here so you can put some things there as well hey guys this is the master bedroom of the property it is really huge you've got your his and her side drawers over there and you've got this beautiful bed in the middle and it has such high ceilings it's just incredible and guys, an amazing aspect of this bedroom is this room extension over here. Yeah, it gives it like a divided room sort of feel. Yeah, the separation, right? Yeah. Yeah, and it's like a walk-in wardrobe, I would say. But it's not necessarily, but it does look like it. Also got an ensuite over here. This guys, is what I love. It's beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, so you've got these beautiful tiles over here. Once again, floating vanity, floating toilet, inbuilt mirror, spotlights as well, and a beautiful high ceiling. And we've got this shower over here that you can just walk in, which is amazing. I, I don't know, I really like the tiling here a lot. It's really, really nice. The marble tiles are kind of giving me life. <laughs> house tours if you guys are interested in this property make sure to contact morgan alexander and let them know that you saw this property by watching this video on my channel also make sure to subscribe like and comment and i will see you guys in the next episode 
Stay blessed and stay happy. Bye, guys. Bye. Look at me, look at me. Tell me what you see. See, I am like a